Good morning. Welcome to day two of Vlogmas. I've got my coffee. Hair's mad. I've just been reading comments from yesterday's Vlogmas and somebody's put, which was just hilarious. She's put, I know you're in Anna now, but that doesn't mean you need to go all Mrs. Slocum on us. Those of you that are not in the UK and those of you that are not as old as me will think, what? <laughs> Mrs. Slocum, there was this sort of sitcom on TV when I was tiny that was called, oh God, what was it? I can't even remember it now. It was about people that worked in a department store. I, I, I can't even remember the name of it. And Mrs. Slocum was a character in that and she had, I think she had blue hair from what I can remember anyway, but she was like an old lady with this big bouffante type quiff thing with, I'm sure it was blue, but anyway, yeah, that tickled me. That really tickled me. <laughs> so I've opened my Look Fantastic calendar and I got a little Espa shower gel and oh, I love Espa stuff. It smells divine. It's really spa-like scents. It's gorgeous. So anyway, that's that one. I... Um, now I'm going to open Ruan's gorgeous advent calendar. What I'm finding with the look fantastic one as well is that nothing's wrapped. It's got the tissue paper in the box, but it, the tissue paper is folded and the little gift is separate to it. So they've not actually been put together, which is a little bit disappointing, I have to say. But anyway, we won't hold that against them. Oh, they're all at the bottom, Ruan. All the early days in December are at the bottom. Where are we? Day two. Day two. I love these these gorgeous little labels. How did you do them or did you buy them? You're going to have to let me know. In fact, I can ask you today because I'll be seeing you this afternoon. Oh, what's this? What's this? Let's move that paper out of the way. So we've got a little, oh, itchy nose. We've got a little net bag with something inside. Wow, it's a little key ring. Look, a little resin key ring, that's gorgeous. Oh, Ruan, that's really lovely, thank you. I love it. Oh, bless her, she's really put a lot of thought into this. We're already on day two. Wow, right, let me pull this away. So, I haven't actually filled, uh, Filmed, no, I haven't scanned the QR code on the Beyond the Pink Door calendar for today yet because there will be a vlog to watch. So I need to, I need to do that. But I can't do that when I'm filming because I'm on the phone. I'm on the phone filming. So yeah, that's. I could suppose I could do it on my iPad, but I don't know if I could show it on camera because I don't know whether I don't know what's in it. I don't know whether there's like a discount code or whether it's just a little chat or what. I don't know. So I'll have a look at it anyway and then see what's going on there. So I'm gonna get under my blanket and drink my coffee. I have had a fabulous night's sleep. Obviously, three nights prior to that we had Layla, didn't we? So we had broken sleep. But I've woke up at eight o'clock, which is unheard of for me. So I've caught up on my sleep now, which is great and I but having said that it's not great because I still haven't cut a pack cut anything out for so soon and I've got to pack and everything um I'm not sure, sure what time yet we're going this afternoon so I need to look at that um yeah my hair is just oh because I went to bed with it still half damp I need to sort this out today and yeah, busy morning ahead while I decide what I am going to cut out for so tuned. So tomorrow, and I've also got to, uh, I, when I used my, when I had my social, I used my Bonina, which is the machine I take to my socials because it's smaller and I bought it for that purpose. 
and the bobbin race thing came out and I can't get it back. Well, it's gone back in right, but it's just not sewing properly because it's just chewing up all the thread. So I had to swap my machines. Wait, Piper, wait. I had to swap my machines and use my own and I've kept meaning to have a look at it to try and sort it out and I haven't had a chance. So I really ought to try and do that this morning. But then again, I think I'm just going to take my faff with me this time because it's bomb proof is my faff never lets me down she says it's gonna let me down now isn't it and I, I just can't be doing with a stupid stupid machine that is really temperamental like bananas are i'm sorry if you've got banana but i'm not a fan as you can probably tell they're just they're just too i don't know they're just too temperamental I get a tiny bit of fluff in them and get have a hissy fit and that's Precisely what mine is. Mine's having a hissy fit, so um, and I just don't have the patience to be sorting it. So anyway, um, yeah, so I'm going to have my coffee and then crack on with getting sorted. We'll do BMS this morning, I think, because obviously I'm going to be away. Um, so we'll be able to do that tonight. And I, I don't know if I'll get this vlog up today, actually, because obviously I don't know if I'll be able to upload tonight because I think we're out. So it might be tomorrow night when you see day two and day three on the same on the same day anyway so i've had a busy morning i have cut out well first not first off i've printed out the juliet dress by silver saga this is the pattern here and stuck all 60 pages of it together cut it out cut my pattern pieces out of the fabric so everything now is done and i just need to sort out getting my machine out of there because that's what I'm taking oh, that's what I'm taking with me rather than my banana um pack up my little caddy that Adam made me which I got with my birthday money last year so I just have put most things in there including most importantly glasses or I won't be able to see what I'm doing and then I just need to put that pattern all in there and I think I'm about there I have got a few bits and pieces to take with me over there for so tune tomorrow and then I still have to oh hang on I'll turn you around there look I'm ready <laughs> I look a lot better than I did earlier didn't I? don't I so I still need to hem the what we call it dress seasons of east dress winter in New York or whatever it's called autumn in Russia I don't know um <laughs> I need to do that because that's been hung up for about three weeks now and I still haven't hemmed it so I'm gonna get that done it's about half 11 then it'll be time to have some lunch yeah I'm on track which is great because I'm meeting Ruan at about half past two at the services that's where I'm picking her up from I am wearing my top that I made in week one of countdown to vlogmas which is the soul of patterns whitcomb 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 top it's just a simple jersey top look love it really nice we're just wearing it with my jeans today because it is super cold it's minus two still outside martin's just got back from walking piper so yeah very cold out there so gonna get that done because i want to wear that dress tonight when we go out for a meal with my metallic boots and some tights you've just reminded me actually i need to pack my tights because i haven't packed those and yeah i think then i am about packed and ready i've got all my clothes packed that i need all my toiletries i've done my hair this morning i've straightened it because i just can't since i've changed the color i do love it but i can't style it i just i don't know it whatever way i style it i'm never happy with it now so whether i do it straight curly or whatever i just i don't know anyway we'll not get into the hair thing again um right so let me get, before I pack up my machine, let me get that dress hemmed. I think I'm going to blind hem it because I think that'll look better on the crushed velvet. And yeah, I mean, I could hand hem it, but I can't be bothered if I'm honest. So no, that's lazy of me, but you know, it's fine. I'm going to, I'm going to blind hem it, I think, on my machine and then that will be done. Why is it whenever you want to sew something, it's always completely the opposite colour that you've got your machine threaded and in the bobbin. Always, always the same. Anyway, I have just burnt the velvet on my, my iron because I had it too hot. 
but it's going to be hidden inside the hem so that's okay um i'm just threading this up oh it's not going to thread now joy of joys right we are sorted so blind hem i'm not going to show you how to do it because there is a tutorial for it in my tutorials tab on my channel if you want to go and have a look but i love it because it gives you a hand finished a hand sort of finished look and without the length of time it takes to, to hand finish uh, i am going to have to hand finish the neckline though because i don't think i have enough well it basically is a turnover and stitch down and i don't think i've got enough hang on a sec that's not right i don't think i've got enough fabric to play with to do a blind hem on it so i am just going to hand stitch the neckline down but it'll be it'll be fine the only problem with this velour is it it's really curly you know on the piper's dreaming i don't know if you can hear him in the background you know on the raw edges although there aren't any raw edges because i overlocked them which i'm really glad about that i did that but having said that it is still curling even with the overlocking which is really irritating this is what i hate about sewing with knits i find it so much more difficult to sew with knits than wovens Come on! Oh yes, it's uh, day two and I've got to find... We're doing this today, well now, because I'm going away soon. So you, it's going to be you, the dog, and your BMS tonight, love. And the cat. And the cat, yeah. Oh, there's a three. And bizarrely, our dog has just opened the door to let the cat in. He has, yeah. He didn't shut the door after him though and no. it's flipping freezing out there. Hey how. Have to bear with me, peeps. That's okay. Oh, that's a 12. It added two on it. There's plenty of time. It's going to be like you, isn't it? It's going to be the last one I pick up. Ha! We have a two. I'm guessing it's another can. We have a dog. Yes, and we're going to have to buy some gravy bones and get the decorations out. He'll have a massive... You can, us when he gets, uh, you can do that while on the way as well. What have we got? We've got a, a brew gooder, AZ IPA. I've never tried this before, but trust me, I will do tonight and I will feed back tomorrow. Are you going to show everybody? There you go. Winning smile. <laughs> you have done well again, good wife. And now I shall do you your poached eggs on toast. For my lunch. Thank you, darling. So we're at Lucy's. Finally got here. <laughs> And we're just getting ready to. Um, yeah. It really does a red in. <laughs> okay. <laughs> it's like, yeah. <laughs> so, <It's> yeah. <laughs> Hello. We're going out for some food shortly, aren't we? Yeah. Meeting up mm -hmm. with Alison, Adele, and Becky. Becky, thank yeah. you. Obviously, I, I know, memory is shocking. See me. No, uh, yeah, just so, waiting for the taxi. We are waiting for the taxi, and uh, yeah. A good night. We're yeah. hungry. We are. Yeah. I'm yeah. <laughs> thirsty. Look who it's out! Look at the Becky! Oh, what was it? Oh, Alison! Oh, Alison! Oh, oh, my dinner's just arrived. Amazing! Yeah. Oh, this is a really flattering angle. Hiya. Hello. <laughs> Hiya. I don't normally sleep with this lady, but anyway. She's lucky tonight. Oh, yes. <laughs> Tonight's my night. <laughs> oh, dear me. Anyway, mm. I'm just going to say good night to Vlogmas Day 2. And it's tonight from me. <laughs> and good night from me. <laughs> oh, dear. Yeah, we've had a really good night. Yeah, we so. Have. Yeah, we're at Lucy's and we're going to be up early tomorrow for 
so too. Yeah. A bit late now. Oh, yeah. What time is it? Oh, it's ten past midnight. Oh, my Lord. It's actually Vlogmas Day 3. It's Vlogmas Day 3. <laughs> so, anyway, good night. Night.